Hi. So in this video, we'll discuss about one of the uh, functionalities in uh, SAP Warehouse Management. If it is ECC, you call it as SAP Warehouse Management. If you're on uh, Hescore HANA, we call it as a stockroom management. The functionalities are similar and the transaction codes are also similar. So the question is like, uh, is it possible to print multiple transfer orders at once? Yes, it is possible. For example, uh, before canceling or before confirming a transfer order, if you have a hundred or uh, 50, whatever open transfer orders are there, you can print by using LL01 transaction. I will show you in the system. Once you confirm the TO, you cannot do that LL01 because LL01 is a warehouse activity monitor where you can monitor the transfer orders or transfer requirements which are not yet closed, not yet confirmed or not yet completed. So LL01 is mainly useful for printing bulk transfer orders before confirmation. Even business also mostly need, need it before confirmation only. So after confirmation, they have to follow LT31 to print one by one. So this warehouse activity monitor, this transaction also helps to cancel or confirm multiple TOs. So in warehouse activity monitor dedicated video, I will make it so that we can keep it in our warehouse uh, module content. Okay. So now let me check it. Go to SAP system. So I will show you in SAP system, go to transaction LL01. Yes, one. You can filter based on the moment type, uh, whatever the moment a dedicated one, if you want to get it, you can do it. Put the cursor on the transfer orders and click determine data again, then click yes so that you will get the transfer orders which are created uh, after that, uh, whatever the time is available, right? So uh, we maintain every four hours, what is the critical time based on that, that I will be determined. So now here, uh, if you want to print multiple transfer orders, double click here, you get all the transfer orders, select all and uh, go to See here, confirm T1 in foreground, confirm T1 background, or cancel T1. You can cancel multiple, and also you can uh, reprint T1. So with LL01, you can reprint hundreds of TOs at once, and um, you can block the bins, or you can cancel the TOs. You can confirm the TO in bulk. So the question is, uh, before TO confirmation, you can print bulk transfer orders by using LL01. It's mostly for the activity monitor. So what are the open documents are available and uh, how long those are pending? Those kind of details can be monitored by using this transaction code. Thank you. Thanks for watching.